depression is a common but serious disorder in today's society. This disorder leads to disruption of a person's normal life and creates negative feelings such as sadness, anxiety, despair and anger in a person. Depression affects a person's thoughts, feelings and actions and disrupts his life. If the common symptoms of depression persist for more than two weeks, it is better to consult a neurologist and ask for help. It is important for people with depression to understand that their current symptoms and feelings are only due to their illness and not their true selves. No matter how hopeless, hopeless and depressed you feel, by understanding its causes and treatment, you can take the first step to feel better and overcome problems. The feeling of disappointment and sadness is part of the normal human life at times, but when emotions such as disappointment and fear do not disappear with the passage of time and intensify, the person may suffer from depression. Depression not only causes a feeling of sadness in all stages of a person's life, but also overshadows his ability to respond to life's problems, perform daily activities, and physical and mental performance, and disrupts a person's eating, sleeping, and pleasures of life to such an extent that even going through a normal day becomes difficult and exhausting for him. While some people interpret depression as living in a black hole or having constant torment, some people feel lifeless, empty and indifferent. Depression may lead to anger and restlessness and greatly reduces people's ability to cope with problems. If left untreated, depression may lead to severe physical and mental disorders in a person. Types of Depression and Its Severity Depression comes in many forms. While the diagnosis of depression is complicated, knowing which type of depression the patient has is helpful in managing the symptoms by a specialist and providing the best solution. Types of depression based on type and severity are Mild to moderate depression Mild depression is the most common type of depression. This type of depression can disrupt a person's daily life and destroy a person's happiness and motivation. These symptoms are usually more severe for moderate depression and lead to a decrease in self-confidence and self-esteem of the patient. Chronic periodic depression, mood swings or dysthymia Dysthymia is a type of chronic but low-grade depression. In this model of depression, a person usually has a mild and permanent feeling of depression, and occasionally the symptoms are completely resolved. The symptoms of dysmythic depression are not severe, but its duration is long, two years or more. In this model of depression, the symptoms are mixed with the person's life in such a way that the person feels that being lethargic is a part of his personality and that he has always had a low mood. In addition to periodic depressions, some people may suffer from double depression, which if left untreated, each period of chronic depression may increase up to six months. Major Depression Major depression is a rare type of depression that is accompanied by severe and unrelenting symptoms. If left untreated, severe depression can disrupt a person's personal and social life and even cause physical harm. Unusual or Atypical Depression Atypical depression is a subset of common depression but with a specific behavioral pattern. This type of depression responds better to treatment methods and drugs, and identifying it in the early stages leads to its quick treatment. People with atypical depression experience a temporary feeling of happiness when dealing with a good event or being with friends, and then return to their sad mood. Other common symptoms of atypical depression include weight gain, increased appetite, excessive sleep, feeling heavy in the arms and legs, and sensitivity to rejection by others. Seasonal Depression In some people, a type of depression known as seasonal depression appears at the same time as winter begins and the daylight hours shorten. Seasonal depression or seasonal affective disorder affects about 1-2% to of people in society, especially women and young people. A person with seasonal affective disorder feels like he has become a different person during winter and constantly experiences symptoms such as hopelessness, sadness, stress, and lethargy. Postpartum Depression This type of depression is usually more serious than normal depression, and its symptoms usually appear within two weeks after giving birth. Women suffering from postpartum depression during pregnancy also suffer from severe depression and symptoms such as sadness, anxiety and lethargy, which worsen with childbirth and make it difficult and exhausting for them to take care of themselves and the baby. Psychotic Depression Severe psychotic depression occurs when a person has a severe mental illness such as delusions along with their depression. 
These delusions can include hearing or seeing things that others cannot see, delusions of committing a major sin, and delusions of poverty or illness.